girl Earl from Embracing Rebounds, and we have with us here today, little Canella, sucking some of her bottle, and we about to get her up and change after she finished feeding, and get her ready for Thin Thursday. Now, I know this, um, I don't know, so for those of you who are new to the channel, first of all, Canella is the color scout. Full silicone baby micro preemie by Claire Taylor. And she was painted in an ethnic version. And we call her Canella. And I am misplaced her preemie bottle. So we give her a few ounces on this little regular bottle here. And we get her burp and get her out of her little carrier. And we'll get her change for today. Here you go, Canela. Are you finished? Here you go, sweetie. That's her little rattle and her little passy. And we'll put those back on her. And get her out this little carrier. Put her on the blanket. Let me make sure she is still in frame. And let me zoom in a little bit. Here you go. Take your little cap off your little hair. So I can see that cute little face. And then we gotta turn your face so all your little aunties and uncles can see your little face. See? I need you to put the longest string on a little micro premium hat. I just realized that. That little string is pretty long. Take off your little booties. And the little outfit that we're going to put her on, it has the feet in it. Now, I bought that outfit off eBay, but however, I have no idea if it's a micro premium outfit, if it's a doll outfit, or if it's a regular BB outfit. And it looks a little too big for Canela. Oops. But we gonna see how it works today. And with the weather dropping, I figure we better put this little baby on something else. Try to keep her little body warm. Let me go ahead to get a little YouTube. Aunties and uncles. Now I help take off your little outfit. And Canela has armatures in both her arms as well as her legs. <laughs> Canela is very, very, very flexible. And I love her little back, the way they got her little back sculpted. I like to keep these little socks on. Here you go. See, in the squishiness of her little chummy. Oh, Canelli. Go on back there. And we can also do a little diaper change today. But she never had a diaper change in a minute. I bought these little... These actually are some little scrunches and stuff, but I think they're small enough to be little hairbands with canela and each one of them have the little bow already on it and these you get let me see one two three four five six six in the pack from trendy dollar on rivers avenue here in charleston south carolina and we're going to change her out of her um disposable diaper and put her in these cloth nappies here by Hi happy honey and if you go back and look at the micro preemie haul, it shows these diapers and it has the length as to where these diapers came from. I got on my page a micro preemie haul. And this is in the size um, micro. And this is actually my first time using them, to be honest with you. I bought her three. They, they were out of a lot of the colors. And... um. 
I wrote them, and I re I re I'm still trying to get a pink one, but um, have yet to get the pink one. So, and if I'm not mistaken, I think this is the little cafe one. Color here, which is like a little khaki. But I figure I'll use this one to decode that because the outfit looks kind of big. And so I figure with this hair being a little extra big, this will help me out. That'll help fill out her little outfit. And this is the little outfit I'm going to put her on. And this little outfit is by Baby So Sweet by You and Me. And it's the pink sweater. The pink little um, tights with the bowls on the feet. And it has the little knitted um, hat and bow. And like I say, I, the pants almost the leather herb. So we could just try this because I know it's way too big for her. But like I said, it's so cold down here. I just want to get her in something warm and when having you on here on YouTube decided for theme Thursday. To pull out your little boots and your warm outfits and get the babies warm back up since we got this little Arctic storm going back on again. I say this is a nice time for me to try this little outfit on her. I didn't bring her mitts once again. But like I said, it's, it's big so it should be easy to get on her. I hope everybody have a blessed week and getting ready for St. Patty's Day. And also for Zen Thursday, she said for those who want to um, go on and put their little St. Patrick's Day things on, they can do that as well. <sighs> Which I got a couple of St. Patrick's Day outfits, but I think I got more newborn size than I have any other size. And this um, creamy pasta that I'm about to put on her is the one by Jolly Pop. No, this ain't a Jolly Pop. Is it, is it Jolly Pop? I think it's a Jolly Pop Micro Creamy Pacify. Yep, it is Jolly Pop. And this is the pink one. And if it slides right in. And even though she's wearing the hat, I had lost a spray for a minute. Let's spray her hair down. It looks a little dry. What do I do with the little hat? The brush. Yeah, let me stay the spray in that. Let me just spray the brush. Stay the spray on her. And I can just spray the brush down. And one thing I like to I asked Claire to, you know, give her thick curly hair and she did. She really does have some thick curly hair. Sometimes I brush it flat and sometimes I just Need the little curls up on top, like I'm doing today. I kind of wet it real down, really good. Make it look like it's in a wrap. Because I knew the hat, which the hat is way too big on them, but we could put most of it in the back. And that is so cute. Let me turn her around so you all can get a better picture. Let me make sure she's still in frame and focus. There you go. And this is Baby Canella. And for those who got Micro Premi toys, I sell these little, um, they're actually little rattles. And this is the lamb one, which I don't know why they would put a tag this long on a little rattle this side. It can almost wrap around his whole body like a belt. 
And I'd hate to cut tags, you know, this kind of tag off because just say, for instance, if a child or somebody get hold to it and if they're allergic to different material or whatever the case may be, they got all that information on here and where it's made at and all that and as well as this toy serial number. So I don't want to cut that off. You know, they're forever having recalls on toys all the time. But here she goes with her little pink and white lammy laying on the pink poodle. <laughs> and that's her other rattle. Now you want to hold that one in this hand so you've got double toys. A rattle, two rattles, and one is a rattle combo. Like I said, this is the little lamb. But it's also a rattle as well. And they got these little micro preemie size right there at Toys R Us. If the one in your area isn't closing down, but... Not Toys R Us. Babies are Us. I apologize. At the Babies are Us. That's where you can find those little micro premium. They got the pink and cream one for the girls. And they got the blue and cream for the boys. But anyway, this little Canela participating in theme Thursday. And she's all bundled up. Nice. And her cute little knit outfit. And even though it's a little big, it looks really, really cute on her. And, and it ain't really that, that big on her. It's cute. I really like that on you, Canela. You know what? Let me, instead of that, let me set you back in your little carrier. They probably can see you better in your carrier. Here you go. Sit back in your carrier so your aunties and uncles can see you much better. There you go. There she goes. Yep, they probably can see you much better on here. I got to get the rest of the kids dressed. So y'all stay tuned. I probably... See, one thing about me, when I got a downtime, because I, like I told y'all, I'm helping mom take care of my dad as well, staying here helping. And I had to take him today to the VA hospital for lab work. But, um... And I brought these headbands thinking I forgot she had a hat because I was going to pick this one. You know what? For the sake of this video, let's try this here and see if these can actually work for headbands. Because then that gives other people out there, when they see these little ponytail scrunches, they might can get them for their little micro preemie. Well, you better stop. Coconella, you got your own headbands. <laughs> How about that? Oh, wow. And I figured they would have fit, you know, and these just the regular ponytail scrunches. And even if you buy the ones without the bowls on it, you can, you can get a pack with the multicolors from the dollar store. And you can always um, buy little different pieces of ribbons and tie bowls on it and make care bands for your micro preemie. You know, I always like to come up with other ideas. These little micro preemie things are very expensive. And it just gives people other options out there that and other ideas that they can use. Because even though I always try to link every place where I get Canela low clothes from. And a lot of things she wearing now, I actually already had linked in a previous video. Because actually I've been ordering clothes for her before she even got here. Didn't know what was, was going to fit and what wasn't going to fit. But if you go back to um, one of my older videos... And it says micro preemie haul video, mini haul. You'll see a lot of links to different stores where you can, um, online stores and shops that you can buy um, micro preemie outfit. But the one that I get majority of her clothes from is um, Marty's Craft. And she goes by Marty on eBay and on Etsy. She got a shop say Marty's Crafts Tiny Babies. And then also I go get some of her things from Jackie Premi Pride and it's premipride.com. Those two I know offhand because I do more shopping at those two than anyone. Because like the outfit she just took off was from Premi Pride. So, but like I say, any video that you see Canela in and you have a micro preemie and you're looking for outfits for your micro preemie, just always check down below the video in the information box and it usually link or tell you where I purchased the outfits from. Now this particular outfit, I like I said, I got this one off of eBay 
And this outfit is not even showing back up in my feed on eBay because I do a lot of shopping. And you know, after a while, they automatically erase themselves. And if I don't do it when I first get it, then I'm too little to leech, you know. But I just wanted to come on here and show y'all her and her little new little sweater knit outfit. And like I said, the temperature, even though we're here in Charleston, South Carolina, today um, it was 50-something degrees in the daytime. At night, it drops down in the 30s. And just last week, I think we've been maybe in 70s or 80s or something like that. But anyway, I just hope everybody stays safe, bundle up in this this these changing temperatures and because the flu is still out there it's still going on and then a lot of people who were sick is having relapses because they're getting sick again because one minute you're warm you need tank tops and shock even though i tell you the truth being here with mom and dad they have the temperatures so hot sometimes i just wake up in the middle of the night just like last night i woke up and excuse my french i really thought i was in hell it was so hot. <laughs> I mean, I, I like, you know, I, it was so hot in this house. I really just wanted to take a blanket and go to sleep in the car. That's how bad it was. Or uh, not tell my husband, don't be alone. I'm, I'm coming home, you know, take the chain off the door. I'm, I'm heading back to the house to sleep tonight because it was just so hot in this house. They have the heat up so high because they're always um cool. I'm having heart flashes. I'm always hot. This is just a mess. But I can t assure y'all I got dressed and went to Walmart one something in the morning to go get me uh, Walmart carry. For any ladies who going out there do the same thing that I'm going through, Walmart carry this. Um, their brand is the Equate brand, and it's called Astro Blend, and it does a lovely job for that. But anyway... I got to keep this station PG so I can't get into no more details with that because I do have kids that will um, subscribe to my channel. So with that being said, y'all would have to do your own research there. But I just wanted to come on with Baby Cadella because I can run my mouth and it's always letting out too much information according to my husband. But I hope everybody is having a blessed day. Cadella just wanted to come on. She's always all pretty and pink. And I know y'all get tired of seeing pink on my station, but it's my favorite color. And even though it's my favorite color, it really don't really look good on me. As far as in clothing, but I do wear pink hair from time to time. Especially the entire month of October, I usually wear my pink wigs for breast cancer awareness. But I see other people wearing pink um, hair out already, so I might break my eyes out on this channel. And come on here. How are you doing? <laughs> anyway, that's your girl Earl from a Brazen Boy. Stay tuned because the other kids are coming up next. Bye.